news releases from other avenues, so from Newsweek or from the New York Times, and looking to actually partner with them to make sure that they're getting they're getting their just due in terms of reporting. Okay. This was another important one, I think. How many of you go to the outlet mall? Anybody go to the outlet mall? Oh my gosh. Okay. Yeah. So the outlet malls have been almost immune, completely immune from uh, e-commerce presence. And so what they're finding is major malls were the ones that were really affected by this. And people would still go out to the outlet mall because they were able to get deals. Well, now it's just not the case. Now they can get the same deals, if not better deals, if not better deals online. And so there's this great article, I'm not gonna read it. Uh, it just talks about how outlet malls now are finding their own space in e-commerce. So they're actually utilizing e-commerce now to uh, advertise. Uh, it's the site that you may wanna know about because you can get pretty good deals on it. It's called, where is it? It is called, oh, it's a Flash, right? So it's Flash Sale Websites. If you go into flash sale websites, you can actually see there's outlet malls now listed on there. So Dick Sporting Goods has, they use flash. Anybody ever get the flash sale? That's all through Dick Sporting Goods has theirs and that's through this organization, flash sale. And so it's called shopperpremiumoutlets.com. And you can probably get some good deals on there as a consumer. So just things to know, it's important to understand uh, kind of how our business trends are, are developing, okay? Any questions on that? No. Uh, several of you have asked me about Google Analytics, and so I'm gonna to talk to you about some tools right now uh, that you're gonna be able to access. They're free. If you're planning on being in marketing, e-commerce, sales, uh, if you're planning on opening your own business, it is imperative that you that you learn about some of these, uh, some of these tools that I'm gonna just introduce you to really quickly. And we'll talk about them a little bit more as we get into the lecture. Google Analytics, though, it's a free, uh, it's free, and it like this one is Google Analytics for beginners. You can do this. You watch a video. Um, you watch a video, or not watch video. Anybody else have issues with the uh, Wi-Fi right now? Yes. What? Okay. So you watch a video. Uh, and you watch a series of videos and they'll give you real world uh, case studies and examples of how to utilize Google Analytics. And you do that and then you can get certified in it. Being certified in Google Analytics right now, if you want to get a job in e-commerce or marketing, uh, it's, you have to have it. Have to have it. Uh, if you take Christina Kahlberg's uh, social media e-commerce and marketing class, if you're a marketing major, you should. Uh, she's going to teach you all about that. So Google Analytics, here's the website. It's analytics.google. Uh, it's their academy. Just type in Google Analytics Academy. It's eight hours. One of my... If